Hey, what's up, UNC fam? It's your girl, Neek, and I'm back with another video. Well, I missed y'all so much. If you are new, I am Neek. If you are not new, welcome back. So today we're gonna be doing a chit chat, get ready with me. I just wanna chat with y'all, you know, we're gonna talk, we're gonna reconnect. We're gonna reconnect because I've missed y'all. I've been gone. I have been going through some things. I've been trying to get some stuff together. I've been working, putting in hours, um, trying to make a lot of stuff happen. So I've been busy and I feel like I've been stressing myself out. So I thought, why not go ahead, make a video, do a video, get, get some stuff off your chest. Um, just today, have a you day. So today I'm gonna have a me day and we're gonna do some makeup. We just gonna be playing some makeup. I'm gonna be hanging out with my sister today. So I thought, put some makeup on, girl, liven up some. I mean, I know I'm beautiful without makeup, but I need some makeup. I need some, 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 I need some of this love, you know? <laughs> I need some love. All right. So, um, yeah, so I've been working, y'all, and I've been trying to get my money together because there's a lot of things that I want to do. My sister was telling me about a cruise that's, um, I think it's in February, and, and I really wanted to go. I really wanted to go. Um, I just need a vacation and, and I need to just get away and um, life has been kicking my butt. But one thing I do know is to stay encouraged. So I'm just staying encouraged and I'm continuing to pray. You know what I'm saying? Like, just trying to, just trying to still do good, do right. Um, everybody has their days where they just, they go through things. Everybody has their days where they go through things and the enemy is busy. And so I just, I just, I'm not going to give the enemy the upper hand. I'm not going to give the enemy the upper hand. He's trying to use me, but, um, no. So, I just, I'm going, I'm, I'm just, I'm going through it. But I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. God is good. God is good. And another thing that I do know is God will put people in your path. He'll put people in place for you. He'll put people by your side. He'll place people in front of you. People that they'll reach out to you. They'll call you and they'll be like, hey, if you need anything, just call me. Love you. I got you. You know what I mean? So to me, that feels good. And that itself encourages me just to keep going, keep standing and um, just to stay positive, just to stay positive. As upset as you get, just stay positive. Because if you don't, you just letting the enemy take your joy. And I refuse. God is just too good. And he's brought me too far for me to be torn down and thrown all over the place and to give up and just to sit and wallow in my pit. No, because let me tell y'all one thing. One thing about me is I have a daddy and daddy didn't raise no food. Daddy didn't raise no food and like y'all, I love my daddy. I love my daddy. One day, one day, I'm going to let y'all meet my daddy. I'm going to let y'all meet him. But he is like, that is like, my, that's, that's my guy. 
It's, that's, that's my guy. That's my guy. I love my daddy. And he... He... He is just the man. He is the man, y'all. Straight up. Like, I'm just saying. He is the man. He is that guy. You know what I'm saying? He is that guy. So, I just... I just love him. I just love him. And if I could give him the world... I would. If I could pay him back everything that he has, like, done. You can't pay. I can't pay him back. But y'all know what I'm trying to say. You know what I mean? Um, I just love him. I just love him. And I appreciate him. But I wish that I could show him, you know what I'm saying, my appreciation. I wish I could just give him I wish I could just show him how I feel you know what I mean I I, I can show him how I feel how I, I can show him how I feel and I can tell him how I feel and I can say thank you daddy I love you all day and I just appreciate everything you do and I just don't know what I would do without you but I just wish that I could just like truly show him because y'all inside that is my guy. That is my, that's my dog. Like, that's my A1. That's my world. Just know that I love him. I love my daddy. And he is, he's a good guy. I was at work, I think, um, not yesterday, but the day before that. When did I pick up that double shift? Today is Tuesday, yesterday is Sunday. So I was at work Sunday. I was coming out of the break room and I was going down to go get lunch. One of the girls at work, she was, um, she was on the outside of the door and I came out of the break room, was headed down stairs and I was on the phone. I had just got the phone with my daddy and, um, I was like, okay, love you. Uh, love you too. And she was like, uh, she was like, love you too. And I was like, Julia, this is my daddy. She was like, oh, I wish that was, I wish, I wish he was my daddy. I'm like, Julia, you don't even know my daddy. Julie, I love her. That's one of my coworkers. But it's, I don't know. It's just, I don't know. It's just, it's crazy because he is like a, he's like my Superman. My daddy is my Superman. I love that man. Yeah, just been going through some things. And I've just been, you know, trying to pray my way through and trying to not get discouraged. Because that is to be expected. To get discouraged, to want to give up, to want to cry, to want to hate the world. But no, I don't got time for that. So I'm just, it's, I know it's, it's all going to work out. It's all going to work out and you can't let it just stress you out. I refuse to be stressed because stress kills people. And I got a long life that I'm going to live. I got some, I got some things planned. So I got no time, you know, to be, to be kicking the bucket. Mm -mm. I just believe that God has some things in store for me. And I just, I have to, I have to keep that, that, that mindset going. At the end of the day, God is going to be the same person. No matter what. And he's going to always be there when we fall short or when we need him, when we call on him. Trust me, y'all. When they say prayer room, I don't, I don't have a prayer room, but I, when I'm in, when I'm in the shower, y'all, I get to talking to God like, like he on my ceiling. No lie. No lie. Now I will, I will be honest. I, I sometimes I don't talk to God like I should, but I, I have a relationship with God, so, but I'm doing better and I'm, I'm keeping that going and, um, at the end of the day, I just want to make him proud. I want to make God proud. I want to make him proud of me. But I'm just, I'm thankful. I'm thankful. You know what I mean? You you have to be thankful. You got to be thankful. No matter what. No matter what. Because 
at the end of the day, it's always somebody going through something worse. It's always somebody that's that that will want to be in your shoes. That will want to go through what you're going through. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. And I'm going to make it work. Yeah. So, it's okay to be angry, which I am. I've been angry. You know, I've been experiencing some anger. But the Bible says be angry. But sin not. So, I'm doing right. And I'm trying to... Keep going, keep pushing. I've missed y'all. I've been trying to get a look out. I've been trying to do a Halloween look. I've been trying to do a Halloween look. But I just... I don't... I don't know what Halloween look I want to do. It's a lot of cool Halloween looks that I have seen. Like, I'm like some dope Halloween looks. And I'm like, I don't know. I don't even know if I could pull that off. But I would have to go, like... I would have to go and get some stuff because I want to do like a bad Halloween look. Like I want to do, like I want to do something dope I that I even shock myself. Okay. But, um, but yeah, so that's what I, I mean, I want to do that. I want to do a Halloween look and I just want to play with that. I want to play with that. And see what happens. I want to play with that. And see what I get. You know what I'm saying. So y'all comment down below. And y'all let me know what. What Halloween look I should do. I want to do it before Halloween. You know what I'm saying. But I think it's pretty dope. Like the different Halloween looks that. Um, makeup artists do. I, I think I like it. I like it. For the longest, I'm like, how are they doing that? What are, how did, how do they do that? But I want to dip my hands into a little um, Halloween makeup. Yes. So I've been working. I've been thinking about going back to school. The colors are in here. Ooh, I want to do a pretty blue eye with some burgundy, maybe. I love earth tone colors, y'all, but I'm so boring. I'm so boring. I got to do something different. Got it. We, we got to switch it up. We got to do something different. So... Yeah, we got to do something different. Can't just keep sticking to the neutral looks. I love neutral looks. I love boring, regular, everyday, on the go looks. But we got to switch it up. We got to switch it up. We got to switch it up. I ain't boring all the time, y'all. I'm not boring all the time. I promise you. I promise. Let's go in to our Morphe palette. Let's do a transition shade. Something on her lid. Yes, but y'all, yeah, I have been, I've been wanting to go back to school and I keep putting it off. I'm a really big procrastinator. I'm trying to make that happen. I want to go back to school um, and get like into the surgery field. So I want to do, um, surgical technology and then probably eventually like a surgical nurse but I better jump on it if I want to do that because I keep putting it off and pretty soon child. I don't want to wait too long because I ain't got time to waste you know what I'm saying time waits for no man time waits for no man 
yeah so y'all <gasps> when I say that's so true I thought I got makeup on my shirt no I didn't y'all I'll be back and forth with what mirror I'm gonna use the way my studio was set up was I had everything on a box and then I had my tripod because I didn't have a big enough tripod. But now I got a big enough tripod and I got all this space, but I had my mirror sitting up here where I, where I could see myself, you know, where I wouldn't have to like hold it or whatever. So I'm spoiled. And now I'm used to something, my mirror sitting up on something. Well, now my mirror's not sitting up on anything. Now I'm, I'm gonna have to hold my mirror, which is fine, but I'm not used to it. So I'm going to have to get used to it. I'm still working on trying to get all my studio stuff together. But one thing at a time. I'm not in a rush. No big rush. But I'm excited. But what was I saying? Getting off track. Y'all, another thing. I think... I have ADD. I think I have ADD. I think I had ADD when I was little, but I was never diagnosed with it. And I know they say you shouldn't speak things on yourself, but I really truly think that I have ADD. Like my mind is like, boop, 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 boop. And then I'm talking about something, but then I'm thinking about something else, but then I forget what I was talking about. And then I have to ask somebody else what I'm thinking about. It gets bad. And so I used to work at a doctor's office where we used to um, screen patients for ADD. It was a pediatric office. And um, we used to screen patients for ADD. And when I would like read the questions, I'm thinking to myself like, this is me. I experience this stuff. But of course you can't say that, you know. So, but I, I don't know. I tell my dad that all the time. I'm like, I think I really did have ADD as a kid. I was all over the place. I was always forgetting something. I And it's not the ADHD, not the hyperactive disorder, just the ADD, the attention deficit or yeah, the attention deficit disorder, not the hyperactive, just the attention. My like impulsive, just doing just crazy stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Fun fact. Fun fact. Yep, I think I had ADD. I think I, I think I have ADD. And so, I mean, it's not bad. I just, my mind is just all over the place. And sometimes I forget about what I'll be talking about. So if I jump off subjects, <laughs> that's why. They were like, this girl is crazy. She she was just talking about this and then she forgot what she was talking about and then she switched subjects and then, yeah, that's me. I'll do that on occasion. I'm sorry in advance. But, um, yes, yes. So I'm gonna do something burgundy, like a neutral. And I know I told y'all I need to stay away from neutrals, but we just, this is how we're gonna start the off. And then we're gonna do some blue because I'm I'm feeling like a blue. I'm feeling, I'm not feeling blue. I got a blue vibe. You feel me? I got a blue vibe. We gonna say that. Yeah, I just, hmm, I think, I think blue, I think blue today calls for a, a blue pretty eye. Something pretty. Something pretty, something popping. You know what I'm saying? Something cute. Intensify the eye. I'm digging this white background too. That's another thing I need to get. I've been trying to 
just change up some backgrounds y'all okay so you see what i mean do you see what i mean do you see what i mean jumping just don't mind it just just hang in there <laughs> okay so i was on youtube and i was doing some research for backgrounds because i'm new to the whole youtube thing and i'm trying to get my backgrounds and my studio together <coughs> excuse me I found this um, YouTuber, her name is Desi. Desi, I think. I think that's right. I gotta find it and put it in the description box below. I'm gonna find her. But y'all, homegirl is dope with the backgrounds, with the setup, with the lights. Like she just went through the whole shebang. She went through the whole shebang. And I was just like, she saved my life. She saved my life and I'm just like, she, I, I, I was like, subscribe, subscribe. I'm your new subscriber because she is, she's down to earth. I like her. She got, she had like a lot of cute ideas. She was like real organized with her stuff. And I was like, okay. So I've been getting a lot of ideas like background and stuff from her so I love her though I love her she has a lot of um she got a lot of personality that's I just love people with personality I love people with personality people think I got too much energy I've met some people with a lot of energy that top me but I do have a lot of energy. Don't get me wrong. I do have a lot of energy, especially at work. <laughs> Y'all, when I'm at work, people be like, I'll have what you have. What did, did you, did you, did you have a, a drink before you came in? Nope. I just got a lot of energy. So I like to try to bring that good energy. What, what they call it, that good juju. Mm-hmm. All right, so I feel like this eye is dark enough. What do y'all think? Y'all think this is dark enough? Or y'all think we should go darker? Darker? I know what I'll do. I'm gonna go with this orange shade here. And I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna add that. What shade is that? We're going in with that ablaze. And I'm gonna just put that in my crease. Another thing is y'all, I do apologize if, yeah, I do apologize if y'all can hear the cars and stuff outside because that's what I need to get to. I need to get a, a mic, a mic to hook up. When I get my camera, I'm going to get my mic. I'm going to hook it all up. And y'all not going to be able to hear all this background noise. Like, I'm in my house, but I'm upstairs. The way my house is set up, I'm upstairs. But I feel like you can still hear, maybe you, maybe you can't hear the cars outside. But sometimes, I know in one of my um, videos that I filmed, you could hear the washer and the dryer and the door was closed. You can still hear it. So, I gotta get that. But I'm still working on it. One thing at a time. All right, so we're gonna cut our crease. And then I wanna put some blue in this crease. All right, y'all. So let me cut this crease really quick and then I'll be right back. All right, y'all. So now that we got our crease done, we're gonna go in with a blue shade 
Now I have a palette, I actually got this palette from, I got this palette off of Wish, but I like this palette and I've used this palette for a lot of looks that I've done before I started YouTube. So when I say make it work for you, bring it to life, that's what I mean. All right, let me figure out what blue. I like this blue. What if I mix them? try to get some Ugh, I'm so boring y'all sometimes well, sometimes I need to try I need to get some new products because I know that y'all are probably like how come she don't try different things and I do but I just I, sometimes I don't think it's gonna work for me like when I did the reviews on the NYX, um, Can't Stop, Won't Stop, NYX Foundation. I was like, I don't know. I'm just so used to my Maybelline Fit Me. I love that. And so I'm like, I don't, I don't need nothing else. But because I'm, because I'm doing YouTube, y'all want to see stuff like that. And I need to try new stuff so that I could, I could, try it out and I can see how it works or I might like it. You know, you never know. My dad used to say all the time, I used to say, I don't eat that. I don't eat that. That's disgusting. I don't eat that. And he was like, you ain't never tried it. So how you know you don't like it? Tomatoes. Hated tomatoes until I tried tomatoes with a Zaxby salad. Y'all, I know it's random, but now I love tomatoes and I'll eat tomatoes with anything, anything. So long story short, try new things because you might like it and it might it might work for you it could be a step towards something i'm gonna go in with some liquid liner here <music> Y'all, this, this is LA liquid, LA Colors liquid liner. And this cut, this eyeliner is bomb. Like this, a dollar for some liner that is like awesome. Amazing. I need more, but it's amazing. Dang it. It's amazing. We're going to go with our NK NYX multifunction lash mascara makeup is therapeutic I find myself not doing my makeup though a lot I find myself doing my makeup less for work I just figure now that I've been picking up more and working more working longer hours I feel like I need my sleep more than I need makeup. 
I used to wake up and go to work and people used to be like, how long do it take you to do your makeup? Like, is, do you do your makeup? Do you wake up early? I wake up like an hour early to do my makeup for work. And I would go to work and people be like, oh my gosh, you look so pretty. And I would tell people like, only if y'all knew what I look like without makeup, I look sleepy and tired. You know what I mean? But thanks. <laughs> All right, y'all. Going in with some foundation. Are we going to give this NYX a try again? Because sometimes I feel like this NYX has been acting up with my face. It's my color. I know it's my color. But it's been acting up. Like it. I don't, maybe my skin is like patchy and acting up because of getting cold. But yeah, so I don't really, I haven't been really wearing my makeup to work recently. A part of me has been getting lazy. Like I love wearing my makeup, I love wearing my makeup. I just get really lazy in the morning. Like I be, I've been really tired. Going in with some can't stop, won't stop. And my face has been doing really good. I've been taking care of my skin, washing my face every night. Not every night, but more. To be honest. I've been washing my face more, more frequently. When it gets cobalt. I get really dry. When it gets warm, I get really oily. And if y'all know of any good moisturizers, let me know, please, so I can try them out and see how they work because my skin, y'all, my skin is, is, is dry. It's been really dry. Like sometimes my foundation will be like, chop! It'll just, it'll be, it'll be patchy. I'm like, why is this doing this? All right, I'm gonna go with a little more on the cheek because I like that extra coverage look. You know me. I like to be full coverage. Got some scarring. What needed to be full coverage? Okay. Okay. Going in with some concealer. So Halloween is coming up, and. My mom's birthday is actually on Halloween. So I was really wanting to plan her surprise party. But I didn't get around to it. And I like I like doing stuff like surprise parties. I don't know. I just like doing stuff like that. And so, if I don't get around to it, I just want to get a really nice gift. Just get her, want to get her something nice. She doesn't really like material things though, like. She might, she might want a purse or something, but. 
I really wanted to throw a surprise party. But I wanted everybody to be there because majority of my family live up top. And yeah, I wanted them to be there and I wanted them to come, but I, I didn't plan it out really well. I mean, it sounded better in my head, but I really wanted to do that for her. So, um, just have to try to do something big for a birthday, but her birthday is on Halloween. And usually for Halloween, um, I, I usually take off work. I won't usually work on Halloween. And I'll um, go with my sisters and stuff to take my nieces and my nephews trick-or-treating. Because I just love that. Like, I don't have any kids yet, but I think that is so cute. Going trick-or-treating with your nieces and your nephews. Because at heart, I'm a big kid. Like... You'll find me like, what are you doing? I'm being a big kid. Excuse me. Thank you. But yeah, I am. I don't know if that's why kids gravitate towards me. Yeah, but I'm a really big kid. Really big kid. I like to do like stuff that adults would be like, oh, I'm too old to do that. Okay. In other words, you're a party pooper. That's what I hear when I hear that. My dad's a big kid at heart. My sister's a big kid. Let's bronze the face up, shall we? Bring some liveliness back to this face, girl. All right going in with our black radiance true complexion contour palette Go ahead and set our whole face. All right, done with that. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna go in with some blush.
for the lip we're gonna do i don't know what we should do for the lip what lip should we do y'all mm. should we do a dark lip I think we should do this lip. What's some of this? It's fall, right? Ooh. Dark lip. up the eyes then I'll be right back all right guys so this concludes this look thank you for just coming by again coming back to um, hang out I hope y'all enjoyed this look um, I'm gonna take some pictures and um, I'm gonna get ready to go and hang on hang uh, nah. I'm gonna get ready to go and go hang out with my sister um, she got some errands that she want to do. Got to go shopping. Want to get some birthday stuff done for my nephew. So we can get that done today. I will be coming. I, so I'm going to be trying to do a Halloween makeup look soon. If not, I'm going to try. I'm going to try. I'm not going to say if not. I still got some I still got some time all the products that I used for this look will be down in the description box below and um also the hair products I'm still using the Jane Carter products which I really really like I'm trying to stay away from the relaxers but for the most part I like it I like how I was um keeping my hair managed throughout the day I don't have to put heat on it just get in the shower wash it get out condition it and put some curl curl coil pudding on it spritz it go about my day it's good get my little baby hairs and we good so thank y'all again for hanging out um as usual it's all love here and together let's continue to grow by resurfacing the unimaginable until next time bye guys